So I got 14 minutes. I'm sorry about uh, the end of the last video. What ended up happening is that somehow um, around this time, my phone charger, when I plug it into any wall, it happened to, to at the hotels that we're staying in too, instead of being like an hour and 20 minutes for fully charged, it takes five hours, some of them 24 hours it says, and, and I can't get it past that five hours and I stick it in the wall, no matter what. I turn it around, it doesn't do it. So something, something with the battery on this thing too. So now it's draining, it was draining like crazy and it just, and it just died on me in the middle of, of um, that was in the middle, but well, it was close to the end anyway, but um, of my last one. And that was about, uh, I think I was talking about my brother Tony. He said, oh, the wonderful things, he's done. Uh, you know, and how, and I still to this day, I don't understand how he made it to Italy and uh, living and working with my cousin who's a journalist and a novelist. So, you know, he does all, all these things. Uh, and he has a television program, a Rai. He gets people on there and they talk, us, they talk about stupid things about, about fashion and all that other fucking crappy shit. And my brother Tony gets to go and interview them. Uh, oh, well, you, uh, let me see. Um, uh, uh, what do you do? Uh, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, really? Ha, ha. You'll be great. You'll be great for his show. Uh, can you come? Uh, can you come? Uh, okay. And do you do the dance too? Ha, ha, ha. Maybe we we'll go out dancing later. Ha, 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 ha. So nobody in my family looks like. I don't give a shit what you say. Oh, but you look like your sister, and you look like you—you you were named after your uncle, your your, your uncle uh, Giovanni, that uh, that uh, somehow mysteriously got shot by somebody at a young age, and we never saw him again. But then we named him after you, <laughs> Giovanni. Yeah, yeah. You look just like him. When you were a little boy, we have a picture of him, a little boy, and you, and you look almost the same. Oh, almost the same. Maybe it was him in the picture instead of me. Two pictures of him instead of me, huh? <laughs> Sorry, some of my guys are telling me, oh, you're getting a little too manic, and people might complain and say, oh, this guy's sprouting all this nonsense about his brother and his sister. You have to take it down from YouTube because it's not true, yeah? Um, all right, if somebody, if somebody wants to spend the money on finding out with this, because I don't got the money to spend... And uh, Tony and my brother Tony and my, my sister Rosie, uh, the only one to do is to take me in the, put me into the mental institution or, uh, or the, the drug place, you know? <laughs> we keep them in there. Quiet down. Don't say anything about, the, you know, you know be, be part of the family, you know? I said, we, we, I, I'm my sister Rose. I love you. I'm your brother Tony. I love you. We don't have a peanut because I heard that shit over and over again. And that's the kind of stuff you do to a child, right? Um, that, that you got to convince over and over again that. And this is another one I'm going to say. You know, I didn't say any of the other ones, and I kept on putting it up. But you know what? Fuck it. You know what my my mother grandmother did to me that I remember clearly. And my sister was no. She and uh, Tony says no. My mommy never did that to you. You're just making that up. Uh, I, I, the things I remember. I remember very clearly. You know why? I, I, I did a lot of acid. I did a lot of um, mescaline and, you know, little, little tabs of, 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 of a purple micro dot. I did all those when I was 15, 16, 17, 18. You know? And those give you a lot of clarity. Uh, you, you, you stupid fucking assholes that, that, that pretend to be my family. Um, you, you, you never did any of those things. So, of course, to you... It's just, oh, they're, they're crazy, and they, they put ideas in his head, and, you know, all these things are coming into his head that, that doesn't belong there. You mean like the aneurysm in, my, in, my, in Kamala's head? That maybe, you know, sometimes something happened all of a sudden that she won Because she has a big mouth. She, I remember her having a big mouth. She tore the pants off of her, her first husband because, you know, to find the track marks. I mean, she's a very uh, domineering, kind of like a, you know, she's a Leo. She's a... Uh, I, that I know of. I don't even know if the birthdays are fucking right in these families or not. So, and, you know, she always had this thing that I have to say something. I, did, I have to, I have to, you have to, there's something, oh, no, we don't, shh, with me? I was, shh, no, 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 no. Hey, Johnny, you play, 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 go, go play, go play, go play, go play with your friends. Don't go too far, though. Don't go too far. Don't, 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 don't say. So a lot of shh. Hey, Johnny. Oh, no, no. Hey, don't, don't, don't. Oh, we are, we are, you okay? You okay? Okay, go, 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 go eat. Go eat. 
So all these, you know, all these little whispering things and things behind my back. And, you know, I was a little kid. I was like, oh, wow, uh, I feel kind of alienated. Uh, I'm going to go hang out with my Colombian, fan, uh, my Colombian friends and head family because they seem, uh, I don't know, a lot cooler than you fucking assholes. But, but um, you know, hey, were you going to hang out with the speaks? Oh, Tony, yeah, yeah, yeah. And those are bonigas, but uh, Munyana, can you hang out with, huh? You don't hang out with the, the nice Italian kids around this neighborhood, right? No, because I don't like going out and beating up uh, the things you just said for fun. No, no, I don't like any of these people. Thank you. Um, I go hang out with the people you don't like. Hmm. No, wonder why I, I like them and you don't. I'm just, I'm just saying, man. Oh, they're going to rip you off. Gonna, you see, you you come right there, you be uh, uh, I wonder where I like them better than. Actually, I, I almost like every other family. I remember being in, I am being in, we're working in Woolbounds in uh, in Lefrak City, uh, Queens, and it's it's it's, it's a project area, you know. So it's, you had the normal project in front of the supermarket. They sold kids sold weed, you know. They had little bikes and and they would sell weed and they come to the car and they sell weed and then the cops would, would come in and, and stalk and then and then they just they just get on the bikes and go into those projects and disappear. The cops would be out there, and then the store going, okay, we're going to go wait, and then, and then they jump on these little, these little BMX bikes, go into the project, and disappear. I thought that was so cool, man. Away. Try, try to come into the projects and find me on this little bike, boom. And then, I, I, I don't know who, you, I had a hood on, I don't know, man. I, I, see, I didn't see anybody coming along on a bike, man. I don't know who that is. I remember working with predominantly African Americans in the store because it was in the project area. And, you know, my sister Rosa, she was in the, the, she was te- everywhere I, eventually she was, she brought me along, you know, eventually, you know, to work. Uh, I was 16 years old. The first job I had was 11 years old. Oh, and then I was going to tell you about the, my mom thing. But I'll tell you in a second. The, the, the first job, I mean, you know, you know, I was like, you know, I was like, Mom, I need a pair of sneakers, man. Fifty dollars pair of sneakers. I'm, no, I can't. We can't afford any of that. But we can afford going to Italy every two year, every year, and bringing two big suitcases of shit to all these people to pay them off to make sure that they don't say nothing. You know? Shh, don't say nothing. I'm gonna bring it these big, big, big or oh, coffee, or uh, oh, go to Starbucks and, and get the, and get the like, uh, get the like, uh, you know, the, get the like, uh, like ten. 15 pounds of coffee, we bring it to Italy where they have coffee, and we just bring it in and give it the gifts every year. But you didn't have a $50 to give me for sneakers, for serious sneakers. She, you know, she said to me, oh, you know, we up after a while, we all have to all go work, so you go get a job at 11 years old, like in a pizzeria, and then, and then you, you, you have the money for then, you know, but then when you go work, you have to, you know, contribute like everybody else, because everybody else, I'm here to keep taking care of everybody, and they, all, they, all my children, they go, I love all my children, they all go out and work and pay. And they pay, you know, they pay, 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 you know, they pay to the house and, and all that fucking luggage that and full of shit that we bring it every and give out it's t shirt. And I'm like, oh, I, all right, so I'm gonna make this money. And then you know, you give a half of that, so I make fifty dollars a week and I give her twenty five dollars. Hey, hey, sure, mom, contribute to the house. That, you know, sure. Eleven years old, pizzeria, and then a supermarket, twelve, thirteen, and eventually I got to Wobaums. At the age of 16, because that's the only age they allowed people to work that young. And, you know, a bunch of people, and I go to school, I go, I go straight, straight from school, straight to work. And then I go home and I study for the, and then I go to school and then go to work. And, and then I had some money, at least I had some fucking money to do something with because these people that, oh, I, 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 shh, don't, don't, I, I'm going to sleep, but don't, uh, Johnny, you, you go into my pockets and get the change, okay? <laughs> I want to notice uh, if you steal the $2 that I have in my pocket. <laughs> I'll give it to you because I love you. And uh, next time, uh, you know, you, you're going to wash my car for me? I'll give you $5 to wash my car. You, you wash it good, huh? You wash it good, huh? So I'm um, 16 and... I'm working with most African Americans. I, 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 I've got, I get really along well with the African American Spanish people. It's like, at times too, a little bit, but you know, you had Fat Tony, hey, 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 he worked in the produce, hey, hey, hey Fat Tony, yeah. My, my, my brother, Fat Tony, yeah. You know, but so I'm Italian, I don't, I don't know, I'm still not sure. So, so, so I remember going and 
going into the the this guy one guy working hey man you want to come over afterwards like yeah just come in. and I'm I'm like in this project area holy shit this is cool man it's like because I always lived in like houses they would put me put in like two family houses or single family houses in Queens like like that it's like but I just like, holy shit and and I'm like I'm in there and like I'm hanging out with with his sisters and his mom was there and they're watching TV and I'm, we're hanging out and he's like hey you want some food hey I'm hanging out with these African American people that my mother would be like, hey, get the fuck out of here. No. What is this a man? No. What is this a woman? Get, get out of here with these people. No. So I'm like, hey, yeah, you know, I, I boom, by, I like music, I like, I, I, you, know, I, you know, whatever it was that was creative, I liked, and this family didn't give a shit about anything but fucking the, 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 the Italian opera singer or whatever the fuck his name is, Botticelli, whatever the fuck his name is, you know? And, this, and, the, and the corny Italian songs that, the, that we, we would go to Italy and that they, they play, oh, I love America, hey, yeah. Oh, you know, so that's, so I would, have, I mean, and, and I was like, yeah, man, this is, this is a cool family, you yeah. Yeah, you're yeah, just John. It's that's good. And you, you all, you all kind of look alike, and saying not not negatively, but y'all look like family. <laughs> and y'all, you know, seem like y'all really cool and like like that. It's like I, w I wish you guys were my family, but no, no, no. no. I, I'm not. I'm just saying that jokingly. But I just say that to every family. <laughs> so um. Uh, I got oh I got three minutes left before I have to delete the next file, and then I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna be down to five. So um, with the wool bombs, did that, you know, went to, and 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 throughout the whole thing, throughout every fucking process. Oh, I remember my oh my my brother. I guess he he didn't know. He wasn't sure if I was gay or not. Because I, your, my, my mother, oh, this is the thing about my mother, I, I'll tell you now. Um, and and um, um, because I, you know, I'm not gay. And if anybody thinks anything about that, no, and not that I have a problem with that, but I'm not. But that son of a bitch, um, what he did was he got some girl that worked there, some slutty girl, to fucking to, 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 to feel like, make, make like she, was, she liked me when I was 17, I was 17 or something. This really slutty Jewish girl that worked there. And she, and she, you know, I went, I got to go to her house and hey, you know, and, and, and I thought she really liked me and it's kind of cool. But then I kind of found out it's my brother and his friend kind of put her up to her. Hey, you know, just take my brother out there. And, you know, she would say all these cool things, really nice things about my ass when I worked there. Like, oh, no, well. And, and that was my first encounter of sex. It was like 16, I think. And, and it was her. And it was brought about by my brother because maybe he thought, but you no, know, now this is, the, this is the thing. I got one minute left. And I might start the next one with this instead because this one is the one that really pinpoints um, the reason that I had a lot of problems integrating with people growing up but the the friends that i had were cool but any kind of relationship that i had with any kind of female was always kind of like uh, it was kind of like uh, i i i, I want to date uh, but i don't i don't i don't i don't know i don't i don't uh, 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 because i had a father who was a fucking alcoholic in living in italy um fucking prostitutes or whatever the fuck he was fucking they are mistresses over there um, and not talking to me, and my brother's like, he's too, too busy, I'm, I'm, I'm busy by almost work, and I got to a, and, and so nobody explained, and this woman was, which was my grandmother, which is like, I don't know, come Johnny, come here, and I'll tell you, now I'll let you know, and the next one, what she did, because I wasn't going to say it, but you know what, I feel like saying